All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Jujutsu Kaisen season two, episode twenty-two, the semi-season finale. Um, last episode was absolutely bonkers. Um, we had Toto and Yuji versus Maito. Uh, the fight was going great. I, well, I think it it was going good. I think um, it, it, the duo were doing great. However, then Maito decided to I'm going to copy Gojo and uh, did a little 0 0.2 second domain expansion ended up making Todo lose his hand, but he was about to lose his damn life, so you gotta do what you gotta do. Um, yeah, in which, in this case, it made it so he can no longer use Boogie Woogie, apparently, which sucks, because he's so good with his ability. Um, Maito ended up Pokemon evolving. Uh, it didn't do shit, because Yuji, with help of Todo, giving a fucking amazing distraction, um, managed to obviously distract him. The Yuji got one hell of a black flash off, knocked him into some fearsome state, like literal, like he's a child. Like a lot of people are saying like Maito is literally a child. Like he's barely been alive for however long. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care if, I don't care if he was born yesterday, bro. Just die. The fuck? Die, cr like die crying, die afraid. You know, if it's Yuji doing it, die afraid. That's that's what I care about. Yuji was popping off. He was really like at the mo at the end there. It's like, ooh, this, this is a little bit of Sukuno right, Sukuno right here. So uh, I was there for it. Not gonna lie. Um, but then yeah, Ghetto showed up. So that was fucking interesting. Let's see what's gonna happen here. How Ghetto's gonna fare against Yuji, or you how Yuji's gonna fare against Ghetto more like. Um, but yeah. Anyway, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. Who this panda? Is he in gorilla mode? Oh, that's his sword. Yeah, was bro trying to just die? Uh, not at the moment. I won't join your side. Yeah. I get that after just meeting him and seeing that. Malaysia? Y'all rubbing it in, huh? Oh, okay. Damn, okay. Hello, Mimi. Um. Hello? Aren't you. Um. Okay, y'all are brother and sister. That was fucking weird. Oh, what? They, like, teleported away? Yeah, you just left Shibuya completely while there's still enemies running around? Did she really run away? That's crazy. Oh, it's this shit again. So, uh, is this going to be Choso? Oh, here we go. Oh, bro's been hiding out. What the fuck? What exactly happened when he touched his blood? It freaked him the fuck out. I don't know what it was. Oh, please let him fucking kill him before Ghetto does anything. Please. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Lord. Did that just swallow him up? Oh, nah. Where the hell is he? That's annoying. Oh, he tried to jump, jump that shit, did he? Oh, damn, bro. Ghetto's just toying with him. Wait, is he talking about what happened in JJK Zero? What did he... Why did he just... Why the fuck did he just try and grab Ghetto? What the fuck is he doing? Oh my god, he's absorbing him. There's no way this is how Mahito goes out. Nah. It's probably, like, torturous, but, like, this... It should have been Yuji killing this man. No way. The maximum technique. Yuji is really fucked up right now. 
Where is Gojo then? Like his cube? Is it just on on his person, or is he hit it somewhere? I don't get it. I don't get what he's talking about right now. Oh, he's eating him. Ugh. Extraction of technique. So he's gonna steal Maito's technique. Oh shit! Okay, of a school. Let's go. I don't know how much help these guys are gonna be, but backup is backup right now. She got a sniper. Damn. Bro, imagine he just throws this bullet back at her. Who's talking right now? Oh, is it? Ah, yes. Get his ass! Okay. I didn't have much faith, but shit, you, were, you went right up to him. Fair play. Uh-oh. Uh oh She's dead. Holy fuck. Oh, Maito! She's so dead. She's so dead. That's fucking crazy. What happened? Who is it? What happened? Who's this? Oh! Damn, he actually showed up. That's crazy. Wow, he tanked that. Holy shit. And people from Kyoto. I'm currently a gorilla. We know. I don't. I don't. I don't see anybody that's going to be able to take on Getha right now. Not gonna lie. Maybe Yuji if he was full health. Oh, Chozo. Wait, Chozo. What side are you going to be on? He's here too. He's on the side of Ghetto. Okay. What is wrong with this man? Wait, what? Noritoshi Kamo. <laughs> Wait, is this someone from his family? Oh, so they, yeah, they're talking about the curse that's inside of him. Okay. What? What? Uh, I don't know what the fuck is going on right now. What? Why is he saying little brother? Is he his little brother? What? How's that work? Is this something he's just kind of made up in his mind? Like fucking Toto did? Anomalies, okay. Oh, then yeah, he knew straight away when they were dead. So, what? In what way? I mean, if he's feeling the same thing as he did when his actual brothers died, then it, it, it must not be like him making shit up. Shit, okay. I mean, wild out. Wait, so that's why he has blood manipulation, because his family lineage deals in blood manipulation. It's intertwining, it's making sense. Oh, shit. Bro, I mean, if we got Chozo on our side, say fucking less. I'm here for it. I need to know how this makes sense, though. Like, how the hell are they brothers? Bro, the amount of blood Chozo is using, fucking crazy. Also got to worry about that white-haired bitch. I don't know what she's about, but she's best friend to Sukuna, apparently, so. Holy shit, dude. I'm going to snipe this bitch out of the air. Oh, get his ass. Get his ass! Bro, this curse has really taken on someone strong with Ghetto. It's annoying. Bro, Chozo wasn't even going this hard against Yuji. Holy shit. I mean, he was going hard against Yuji. But not this hard. Maybe it's because they, they were underground. I don't get Chozo then. Is he like human 
Curse. Bit of both. What is he? Would that be a spoiler? I have no idea. And you know what? I fuck with Chozo. <laughs> we, need, we need to understand how this family lineage works, but fuck it. I love it. <laughs> Yuji's like, hell no. What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> That's true, actually. Yeah. Is it even on him, though? Like, where the fuck is it? But then, I think, didn't Panda say that he could... Wait. Oh, what the hell? You got ice powers, bitch? Of course. Oh, shit, son. I was probably just imagining things, but, um, what's his name? Kusakabe? The guy with the sword? It looked like he was running towards Yuji, not towards them, but I must have just been imagining it. Oh, shit. Don't shoot me. Oh, damn, Yuji. You broke his ass out. Yeah. You're going to have to explain that one, Chief. <laughs> Bro, Yuji's just getting brother on brother. That was a pretty cool attack. Didn't do shit, but it was pretty cool. He? I don't know. I don't know what gender this person is. Not gonna lie. I have no clue. Is this a man or a woman? Could be both. You know, I really do appreciate that backup, but by I look at the people from Kyoto and I'm like, you're not built for this. Not gonna lie. Oh, what the fuck? That was a weird cut off. What happened? Who's this? Hey, fucking yo! Oh, shit, we got a special grade here. Oh, fuck yeah, dude. Oh, she's gonna be nasty. No way! We got to wait till the final episode to see her fight? God damn it. Right, so that was Jujutsu Kaisen Season 2, Episode 22, the semi-season finale of the season. Um, wow, what a good episode. Lots to unpack there. Um, Kyoto showing up as backup, shout out them for real, even though they're not built for this. But there's an, there's enough people going up against Ghetto, so it might help. Um, but and then again, there's also the white-haired person as well. Choso, uh, I, fuck it, we 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 <laughs> we take the support, um, regardless of if he believes he is the brother or not. It, it really seems like it's more than just what Toto feels towards Yuji, because of like how he was able to sense his other brothers, and then how he was going on about sensing what he did in Yuji as well. So some kind of explanation there would be interesting. Um, the and the way he was talking about the guy who the, or the care spirit that kind of infected. His birth, and I suppose he did say his mom was human, so he, I guess he's at least half human. Um, and how that person was related to the other clan of the Kyoto guy who does blood manipulation, so I guess that, that explains how he can do that. Yeah, um, wow, yeah, I'm, I'm very interested in episode. And then at the end here, Yuki showing up, we got a special grade, or what are they called in um, uh, Jujutsu? Uh, the special class, or sp are they called special grades still, like the curses as well? I don't know. But... She's strong as hell, um, because there's only like four special grades. So we will see what her what her ability is and um, if she's going to be of any use here. I assume she will, because she's she's her. But yeah, anyway, guys, I really enjoyed this episode, and I hope you guys enjoyed it too. I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction along with me. Have a nice rest of your day, and peace out.